guys see a specific kata on certain levels, I did it for a reason, and it was because of skills. I feel, when I, when I developed uh, Budo Dini Jitsu, everything under black belt, everything under black belt, is something that helps develop the skills needed to work on the kata from the scrolls. I understand that other schools do the traditional kata from the scrolls underneath black belt, but in my opinion, none of those organizations are as good as we are. And I'm saying it, that is just the way I see it. They're, they don't have the skills. They may be doing a kata, but their skills are not good. Everything you guys do under black belt, you guys are tested on all the waza, all the different punches, all the different kicks, all the physical training, your sparring. You need to have all of those skills down and be good at those skills before you actually learn the kata. Because if you can't fight, and you can't take a warrior concept and apply it, learning a kata with a stick, you look like someone who can't fight swinging a stick. Do you catch what I mean? So I, I do understand that when you guys, when we look at placement and where I put certain things in the curriculum, it's because I feel that the emphasis doesn't need to necessarily always be on kata. The emphasis needs to be on skills. You guys are coming here to learn a skill, to make yourself better, to get knowledge. Do you catch what I mean? And you guys don't want to learn something and then turn around and not have it work for you. You, you, you want to learn something so that you can apply it. 